Okay, so the experiment continues. Here we are. It's been, uh, this is Tuesday. It was one week ago when we uh, put the seeds, spread the seeds on the uh, Chia Myers. And uh, we've been watering now uh, for, I think this is maybe the sixth day. And I'm still seeing no sprouts. So uh, some of you suggested that it might be uh, the cold weather, that maybe I shouldn't have left him outside those first two days in the cold weather during the day. Um, so I have been bringing him inside uh, the last couple of days, but um, doesn't appear to have made a difference. So I'm gonna water him today and uh, take him back inside. And then tonight uh, I'm going to try the uh, plastic bag loosely around him. The instructions say you can put a plastic bag around him. Uh, don't let it touch it and uh, that will help speed up the process and kind of create a greenhouse effect. So I'm going to try that tonight and see if that works and uh, maybe give it another day tomorrow and if none of these seeds are sprouting by then, then I think we're just going to have to start over. So Let's go ahead and water him for today. I am glad I saved a bunch of the seeds in the packet that came with this because uh, we do have to start over. Of course, now I'm determined we're going to see something sprout on this shape's head. All right, so uh, there we go. It's Tuesday, February 20th. About a week into this Chia experiment. Okay, so uh, here we go. I did uh, cover it with a plastic bag overnight. Maybe a little late for that, but in hopes that uh, we might see something happening today. So for the unveiling, <laughs> well, it does look like uh, something might be finally starting to happen, amazingly. I think the, the bag actually helped. Wow. Look at that. Starting to see a tiny bit of sprouting. Better late than never, I guess. All right, well, I was going to say if there wasn't anything happening by today, I'd start over, but... We might have to keep this guy going right now. All right, I'm going to put uh, put some more water, water him again, and uh, definitely going to do that plastic bag trick again tonight. Yeah, so I just wanted to move him outside for a minute so we can get an even uh, better look. But you can see a little bit here, and uh, I'm noticing it's mostly on the right side, a little bit on the back, and but not as much on his left side, so I don't know. He might... Uh, the, uh, get kind of half uh, uh, had a hair grown here but <laughs> we'll see how it goes but I'm just thrilled to see just a little bit of greenery sprouting there um, all right so I'm gonna go ahead and water him for today and then I'm gonna move him back inside because uh, I do think that's working a little bit better now, keeping him inside during the day and then doing the plastic bag over him at night. Whoa. All right. So now he is watered, ready to go. Empty the uh, drip pan. There you go. Got a little bit of action going. All right, so this is our update for Wednesday, February 21st. Uh, just over a week of this experiment. So, um, excited to see something happening today. Let me know your experiences if you've planted one of these Chia Pets. Love to hear from you in the comments. All right, here we go. Uh, we let it 
sit covered in this plastic bag for the second night in a row. So let's see what kind of uh, growth we might see today. Look at that, starting to uh, see a little greenery here. Definitely looks um, greener than it did yesterday. Yeah, he's uh, he's growing, he's sprouting. Let's uh, let's move it outside uh, for a better look and uh, get him watered. But yeah, I think the plastic bag <laughs> makes all the difference. At least it has for us. So here we are outside. We can get a little bit better look and you can see some of that glorious greenery coming in starting to get uh, pretty visible here especially on this side on the right side as you can see uh, on the left not quite as green up here on the top left side so I don't know maybe I'll try to uh, just set him facing a different way than the last few nights maybe I don't know um, but that suggestion in the instructions to put the plastic bag over at night that is definitely uh, the difference maker for me anyway so far that made all the difference and also uh, here we are it is uh, Thursday um, I don't know what day this is since we started all of this I just know it's after two nights of uh, covering him loosely with a plastic bag so uh, here we go with his daily watering And uh, then I will carry him back inside, even though today's a little bit warmer than it's been. Still in the low 50s, and uh, I don't know if that was doing him any favors, keeping him outside those first few days in the cold weather. But in any case, we've got action going now. Hopefully it's going to fill in on this side, or he's going to look kind of funky, but either way. And I mean, even just looking back here, even on the back, we've already got a couple kind of... Uh, jutting out there it's gonna look interesting as it continues to grow and once again if you're watching this and uh, you've done this with the Chia Myers or any Chia let me hear about your experience in the comments below and stay tuned for more as the experiment continues all right, after three days doing the plastic bag greenhouse effect, let's see how he's looking today on Friday. All right, man, we are, we are getting some uh, greenery here, especially on the right side. Wow, look at that. A little bit more on the left. Man, he is coming along. All right, let me get him um, outside for a second. Yes, he is uh, finally showing signs of life here. Look at this. Michael uh, getting his Joker green on. There we go. Get him a little bit more in focus. Look at that. Better late than never, right? Finally coming along a little bit. A little bit more up top here, not quite as green, but it, it's coming in. So happy to see this. <laughs> he is taking shape, finally. All right, let's give him his uh, daily watering now. And uh, yeah, I'm going to keep going with the plastic bag over top at night because that has really made all the difference in my experience on this experiment here so uh we're gonna keep going like i said today is uh friday and uh we're gonna keep going Sharing these updates. 
So stay tuned for more on the Chia Myers experiment. All right, here we go. Our Saturday morning unveiling. Let's see how he's looking today. Look at that. He's, he's getting a little bushy around here. Wow. Look at this. He is coming in pretty nicely. Oh, man. It's amazing. Uh, once it does start growing, it really grows pretty fast. All right, let's move him outside for a minute and uh, get a better look and uh, give him his watering for today. But, uh, yeah, this looks great. Plastic bag trick all the way. Here we are outside again to get a better look, and uh, you can see a little bit there kind of not as green as the other kind of hard right there. I don't know what that's about or why that's coming in like that, but over here on the back side, man, coming in real, real nice and thick over here, nice and bright green. Kind of uh, looking like he's supposed to on the box from, from this angle. Very cool. Just thrilled to uh, finally see some growth happening after a week of uh, none. But yeah, he is off and running now. Look at that. <laughs> Looks a little shaggy around the back, kind of like the mask is supposed to, right? So again, today's Saturday, February 24th. We are into this uh, over a week now. I'm going to give him his daily watering now we can find the hole through that forest of greenery and uh, then we'll bring him back inside and I've been letting him just kind of chill by a window uncovered throughout the day and then each night now covering him with that uh, plastic bag and has really made all the difference these last few days all right so there we go a little saturday update as the chia myers experiment continues okay here we are with our sunday morning update let's go for the unveiling and there he is. Wow, getting nice and bushy. Look at that. Holy moly. He is coming along very nicely. Let's get a better look outside. And here he is outside. Look at this. Starting to look much more like the box, like he's supposed to. Look at this. Coming in very nicely now. I mean, I am just astonished at the difference it has made every day since doing that uh, paper bag loosely around him overnight. Now there's still these areas here where it's not really green, it's kind of gray. I, I don't know what's up with that. Kind of white down over here. But I mean, the vast majority of where he's growing is looking I think exactly like it's supposed to, like right over here. That looks really great. So there he is from the back. The profile. Straight on. And the left side profile. Looking very nice this morning. And again, I mean, it's almost to the point where we could trim a little bit, almost, I think. Um, some of this a little bit. But um, you guys let me know what you think on the progress so far. bit brighter and uh, meanwhile I'm gonna go ahead and give him his daily watering for today if we can find that hole down in that forest of greenery now I 
All right, there it is. Okay. Just under two weeks into this experiment, and there we go. He's coming along nice. Look at that. The Chia Myers experiment continues to take shape. Hey, happy Michael Myers Monday, everybody. It has been uh, just under two weeks since we started this Michael Myers Chia Pet experiment, and we are going to unbag him this morning and see what kind of progress he has made overnight. And there he is, looking bushier than ever this morning. Check it out. There we go, in focus. Look at that, coming in very nicely now to celebrate this Michael Myers Monday. Let's step outside and get a better look. All right, check it out, guys. Um, what a difference a week makes, right? Uh, he is filling in nicely. Uh, still have a bit of discoloring here up front, but even that looks better today than it did yesterday, to my eyes anyway. Uh, here you can see in the back where he's really filling in. Maybe not quite as full as the box would suggest, but uh, pretty daggone close at this point. And uh, again, I am just blown away at the difference uh, from last Monday, which <laughs> It's still done very little, but uh, we are now, like I said, just under two weeks since uh, the initial planting, the spreading of the seeds, and uh, he's looking really nice today. As we hear the birds singing out, it's actually in the low 60s today, so uh, some nice warm weather for a change. We'll still take him inside, though. Now... I can barely even see the hole down there now because he's so grown up. So I'm going to make just a little bit of room and uh, give him his daily watering. And then I am going to cut this into uh, our weekly update which we'll watch together during tonight's Michael Myers Monday live show. Okay, there we go. All right, once again, I uh, look forward to hearing your comments on this. Let me know if you own this guy and how yours has come along, if you've unboxed him and planted him. Um, let me know what you think of my progress so far. And I'm going to keep going with this thing until um, the instructions say eventually it'll start getting kind of uh, overgrown and discolored. And that's the sign when it's kind of lived its life and we start over. But I'm going to keep going and I'm going to keep doing these daily updates as we go. But I would love to hear from you guys. Let me know again what you think what I could be doing better, differently. Would love from, to hear from you. And of course, subscribe for lots more on all things Michael Myers and everything Halloween here on the HDN YouTube channel. Until then, I'm Matt Arts for Halloween Daily News. Thank you for watching.